Well, I'll do that, chums. I'm back inside of Light No Sky. Now, I have to travel over to this manufacturing facility, which is over the Creola Kingdom. I'm only seven minutes away from the Creola Kingdom. And let's have a look who's online right now. View nearby player list. Okay, good. Okay, cool. I think we're good. I don't think many of those are Creole Kingdom right now. So you can't use your ship in this. So I'm going to be leaving my ship right here. I'm going to be taking my little beetly friend. I can't summon him on this platform. Let's jump up of here then. And let's get ready to fly, people. Right, so if I am getting ready to fly... Oh, Sir Onimus Gaunt has hit me up. Right, let me just accept this. I'll tell him I'm making a video and it's probably not the best of times. Okay, right, well, he, he hasn't actually appeared. I don't know what's going on there with Mike and all that sort of stuff. But anyway, I'm going to be putting it into my survival mode. Because, yes, we're venturing off from this safe haven. Let's bring in my little beetle. Let's go, little beetle. And ride. To the skies we go. Right oh. Well, this is going to take me quite some time to get there. You can see that it's all the way over there, six hours away. Now, I am trying to steer clear as much as I possibly can of the Creole Kingdom. I mean, if I have a little sneaky butchers with my eye peepers as I fly over, I mean, it, it happened by accident. You know what I mean? Hold on, what's this over here? Is that a manufacturing facility that I spy just over this hill? Hold on. I think, that's I think this is an observatory. I don't think it's a, a manufacturing facility, but I could be wrong. Let's see if we can spy the doors on this thing. I'm not very good off the top of my head of just spotting things and knowing whether it is a manufacturing facility or not. Right, has it got the reinforced door? I'm going to jump off and have a look. No, it's just a normal one. Okay, All right, well, let's, let's head inside quickly. Ah, yeah, this is where you can find distress beacons and stuff. But I'm just going to nick this little hockey puck on there. Lovely. We'll chat to this guy. Sometimes they might give you something good if you if you help them out. Um, up or back. Okay. Right. He didn't like me for that. Okay, right. Manufacturing facility that way. Wait, Beetle, come here. Beetle. Ride. Okay, cool. We'll just carry on then, peeps. All right, fine. Well, hopefully I'll see you at the manufacturing facility. Or I'll hit you up if something interesting happens if I come across something cool. Oh, look at that. We just popped a milestone or something. Okay, John. So, while I was flying over to the manufacturing facility, which is over there, six hours away, I've actually come across a manufacturing facility in the wild. Now, this is really close to Cynical's base. I mean, look. He's only like 30 minutes away. And I've just put down a base computer and I've claimed this as the 07 crew. I'm going to put like a teleporter here and I'm going to claim it as 07 so all of my crew can get here to use this facility right next to freaking Cynical's front door. So let's just knock ourselves into here, shall we, people? And let's see if we can do the puzzle inside. I don't know whether I need Pogium to slaver on the terminal. Hopefully not, because I haven't killed any Sentinels yet. Here we go. Let me interact with it, dang it. Why can't I interact with it? Well, it's it's broken. For fudge sake. Okay, chums, well, I've broken into this facility. And I've done a reload. And I still can't interact with this. It's not letting me interact with it. I don't know what's going on. Maybe somebody else in multiplayer has already been here or something. Um, but I, I was going to wait to see if that helps. No, I, I can't actually interact with this terminal. So, I don't know what's going on there. I think it's slightly broken. Yeah, that's foobard, isn't it? That's totally foobard. Right. Um, uh, I've, I've no idea there, people. That's bizarre. Well, you know what, people? Because this is... It, this is Seriously broken. I, I don't know what's going on with it. I might just go and unlock the atlas. Oh, I'd fly to another freaking one. That's not good, though, is it? It's not good at all. That's broken. Flying fudge. All right. Well, I guess we might as well delete this base computer. I was quite, I was quite happy that I'd managed to find something on Cynical's doorstep. 
In fact, it looks like my base computer may have freaking vanished anyway. What the actual flying? Really? How? How has that even happened? Where's my base computer gone? Oh my days, this is just a broken game, isn't it? I'm going to quit all the way out. I'm just going to exit the game and I'm going to load back in. Right, well, these auto saves really do my head in. Because it's actually auto saved when the doors have been blown up. And I can't interact with this console. All right, well, we're just going to continue on. And we're going to have to write that one off as being a failure. Now, something that used to work in the past is if you put one of these down buy a facility let's give it a go let's just give it a go quickly so if i make some carbon nanotubes carbon nanotubes i just i'm just going to experiment let's see if it does still work if you put this down inside of a facility that you want to find another one of and then hit it up locate nearby structure what it used to do is find you another one of the exact same structure but no, I think it's found me a freaking crashed freighter. Yeah, which I could see with my freaking eyes, let's face it. So that was that was no good. All right, well, I wasted the navigational data testing that. All right, well, if I run around here, there should be a little save flag around here that I can hit up and get a free navigational data. That has seriously cheesed me off, people. That is, That's really annoying. So I've still got to continue going all that way. Six hours. Yeah, not a happy bunny. Not a happy bunny at all. Okay, right, well, there we go. Beetle time again. Let's just hope I come across another one of these manufacturing facilities on the way to this manufacturing facility that for some reason the map thought was a good idea to stick this like three days away when it's quite obvious that there was a manufacturing facility right near us, you know? Okay, right there, chums. I'm not going to make any mistakes this time. What I've done is I've hit up this. I've called my ship in. And I've jumped in my ship. Out of my ship, doing it again on stream. There we go. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to leg it over here. I'm going to hit up this save beacon. That's going to give me a navigational data. But that's created me an auto save and restore point now. Now, I'm not. I'm, I'm still not at the freaking place I need to go to. So the one that I was going to is... Where are you? All the way over there. Still six hours away. This was just over the next hill. Yeah, I just grabbed, jumped on my beetle, started flying, and came across another one in a stone's throw away from the other one that was all corrupted. Righto. So it's still near to Professor Cynical's territory. Where is Cynical? Okay, that's Viking at Arms. That's the O'Brew 7 crew. That's Empire, two hours away. Creo Kingdom. 26 minutes away right okay let's try that again so let's find the front door and let's put down a base computer and hopefully this time it doesn't freaking despawn or disappear or anything maybe it was the base computer that upset things i mean i've got a save here now haven't i so let's just let's just shoot the doors in okay let's just shoot the doors let's just get in as quick as we can and let's see if we can solve the puzzle this time let's see if it lets me do it Aha! See, that's what it's supposed to do. Right, OK, here we go. Alarms blare sounding out against the intrusion. The facility is remotely operated and no one responds to the klaxon call. The terminal indicates the facility was undertaking a specialised piece of research. OK, here we go. This terminal appears to be asking for manual confirmation of its experiment. OK, I'm going to go for end experiment then. There we go! Heck yes! Sweet. Now, I don't want to keep pressing the button quickly here because I need to select the right option to get my Atlas Pass level one. Learn new recipes. That's what I want to do. And I want to learn this one. OK. We've got it. Heck yes. So I just need some copper. OK, right. Now that I've done this, I am going to get myself a lovely, lovely base computer. I'm going to stick my lovely base computer right here. Chicka boom. And I'm going to set to work and make a little base here. Just a teleporter. Make it 07 crew so the 07 crew can come here and all get their Atlas passes. Heck yeah! Okay, right. Now that I've claimed the base, 
what I'm thinking of doing is because this is now an 07 safe haven, is while I'm building, I'm just going to change it from survival into normal mode, okay? And I'm just going to change the networking to uh, n yeah, no one for PvP for now. Okay, cool. Now I can set about building my base here. Lovely jobs. You know what? I'll reconvene with you after I've built the base because I don't think I've got what I need to make a teleporter. Or have I? I only need two carbon nanotubes. That's not a problem. I can have that built in a jiffy. Now, because this is just out in the sticks, it's not my base. I'm just going to make it just... It's just for you know, getting here's sake. So, yeah, I'll reconvene in a bit. I might put a big 07 logo on the roof, though, you know, since Cynical put a bloody crayon over near my freaking region. OK, well, I've, I've made a very small base, just enough to upload. It's just a portal with some power. Anyway, let's stick this into here. I haven't put a big sign on the top yet. <laughs> 07 and it's manufacturing facility man. You factoring Basil IT. Now, hopefully, if any members of my crew come here, they should be able to get the Atlas Pass themselves. At least, I hope that's the case. So, I've put some planters there so you can get this to power this to so then use this. And I'm going to use that to go back to my own base because. Flying all the way back to my own base would be a pain in the freaking backside. But before I do that, can I put an 07 brew crew thingy on here? Let's have a look. Uh, right, indoor type stuff. I want one of these. Yes, please. I want it as big as possible, please. Yes. I'm going to do it black. Out. Um, I've got a scan. I've got a sentinel scanning me for some reason right now, and then I'm going to get an O. We need that in white, or else I'm not going to see it, are we? There we go. Make it a bit bigger. Cycle through until we get to the seven. Make that even bigger. There we go. Isn't it lovely? Isn't it wonderful? Heck yes, it is. Right, there we are. <laughs> That's going to cheese Cynical off when he sees that. Right, anyway, let's go and um, upload this. I mean, it's 30 minutes away. He's put one on my freaking doorstep, so he's still winning on the old freaking trolling. There you go. Done. There we are, uploaded. And then I'm... You can hear that little... I get this a lot. This is going to get worse and worse and worse, and then my game's going to crash in a moment. It's because of these little butterflies outside of here, and also the sentinel noises. It interrupts with the music. I don't know if you can hear this, but it's really distorted right now. Give it another, like, two minutes, and this will crash. So, it's lucky that I built this um, terminus. It's going to get me back to my little base. Um, your bases, your bases. And, yeah, there's my manuf manufacturing current location. And we're going back there. Cool, let's go. You hear it. It'll sort itself out as soon as I've walked and get back. At least now if I've got that sound glitch, I can just walk to this base and walk back again. Save my game from crashing. Well, that's a bit of an extra bonus. And we've arrived, Akated. Sweet! I'm back! Heck yes! Mission accomplished. I haven't created my Atlas Pass level 1 yet, though. Now, I think I've got Oh no, I turned all my copper, didn't I? Into chromatic metal. Look, I've spun it all into chromatic metal. Dang it! Did I leave my... Oh no, I didn't leave my refiner on the hill. But for me to craft my Atlas Pass, I need copper. Okay, so it looks like our mission isn't over yet, people. We need to find some copper. Sodium. Sodium. There's not going to be any copper here, is there? Oh, really? Not my morning. Paraffinium. Fudging heck. Um, come on, copper. Where are you? Okay, well, it looks like I might have to get on my little beetle and fly around for a while until I actually locate <laughs> some 
copper. Okay, all right, people. I'll see you in a second. I'm just gonna get my beetle. Oh, I better put it back into the old, the right mode since I'm going away from my base. Yeah, there we go. Survival. Yes. And I want to go into networking, and I put my PVP to anyone. Where's my beetle freaking gone? Where are you? Where are you? Oh, there he is. Quick! Get him! Right. Right, I'm going to go... Is that some copper right there? No, it's not. That's paraffinium. It's like a, a silvery colour. What about there? That looks like paraffinium too, maybe. Okay. Well, we'll head over this way where we're still in sort of like safe ground. But yeah, I'll let you know when I find some copper. Chums, you can use your scanner on your freaking um, beetle. But look, I found some copper right here. Lovely. It's not too far away from my base. There you go. I'll jump down. Let's go get this copper. I might have to get rid of this tree. Get rid. Oh, no. Sentinels are now investment gated. Now, oh, well, I'm going to just get all the copper out of the ground and I'll reconvene with you in a moment. Anonymous. You all right, buddy? Sorry, my game crashed out, mate. Yeah. yeah. Not, not a problem. I'm actually running around the countryside with um, Good Guy Spree. Oh, yeah? Isn't he part of the Empire? Yeah, he is, but um, he's just starting out. He's just starting to build. And I did... Um, I come over, he seen me, and I thought I'd say hello, so... <laughs> she is saying hello to the enemy! Yeah, I know, but uh, he's just starting out, and... Okay. I, 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 listen, if I was to shoot him, yeah. it would be an unfair advantage. It would, you're a knight, I suppose, yeah. But, yeah. Um, yeah, we're, we're checking out Rice's base together. Oh, cool. Um, give me a second, I'll invite him into the group, because... I appear to have anyway, lost let's them, go through these. Look, I've got one navigational data. i got a warp cell that I don't really need. Another navigational data. Heck yes. And another. Brill. We're getting loads. So, Brew Crew, once you've got your Atlas passes, you should be able to come here. See what I mean? I mean, I could decline, but I hit. Okay. There you go. Hello there, buddy. Hopefully he's going to appear again. You're right, mate. I'm just uh, using my Atlas Pass on all of my canisters and getting loads of navigational data. I had one of those Atlas Passes for you. Yeah, I know. I wanted to get my own and uh, do a video on it, so I've got all my video created now. And I've also claimed a manufacturing facility, so that's all good. Oh, you're right here. Hello there, mate. Cool. Oh, yeah. there's the salvage I... glass. Cheers, man. Well, I got that from all the sentinels that I killed. <laughs> <laughs> Have I got anything I can give you in return? Would you like some fibrous I, stew so you can run fast? I'm actually spot on. I've got quite a lot of stuff. Oh, okay, cool. All right, what well. I'm trying to, what I'm running around looking for is star silk, because I promised Stormageddon I would have a look. Star silk. That's going to be hard to find because it's only found in certain out systems. Rather than land and throwing something down. Well, I can't throw any, any save editors down or put any red stars anywhere now. Because you only oh. get five. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it, it, it's a bit dodgy, isn't it? But at least you get five. You know, it's not too bad, I suppose. Yeah, And not yeah. all five are um, over in Cynical's area because I wanted to let them know the brew crew hmm. were round and, around, round and about. Yeah, uh, nice. Cool. Hopefully I you mean, see he's them. got that big bloody crane. <laughs> yeah, well, the manufacturing facility that I've just got that's 30 minutes from his base, I've stuck a massive great big 07 billboard on the top of it. So. Oh, you absolute legend. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> pretty nice. And also, you know, he's already green-lighted that anything that we claim as 07, we can use our teleporters to get to. So now we're half an hour away from him if, when PvP yeah, starts. Oh, the sound glitch is starting. Is it starting for you? No, I'm fine. Okay, mine's starting to go. Bzz, 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 what, bzz. what to do is go into your ship. Yeah. And that'll deaden the sound because that's what I did when I was talking to Cynical earlier. I give it a go. But, um. Where is my ship? It's in the lake. What I found is I can use the teleporter now to teleport back to the other base that I was at and then teleport back here again. But I think it's because of the butterflies. Oh yeah, that that's that's made the sound go lower. Let's see if it's reset it. I'll jump out. Yeah, that worked. 
Nice one. Told you. Sweet, thank you. Oh, wait till you see this. Um, Cynical oh. gave me an egg. Really? Did he? Yeah. It's wow. It's got a couple. It's got 20 orders to hatch, but mm. I wanted to show you this one that um, I have. Okay. Now, check out the colouring. Oh, he's red and black. He's pretty cool, isn't he? I thought Very he was nice. red and white. On me, he's red oh, and red white. and white, red and white. Sorry, yeah, red and white. Mine's flying around as well. Mine's green and yellow and blue. Okay, jumps uh, the sound glitch is happening yet again. I don't know if you can hear it. Here we go. Look, let me welly the sound right up. Now, you, you probably hear it now. It's all very stuttery and weird. You hear that? And it gets worse and worse and worse, and then my frame rate drops to like two frames per second. And then my game crashes. Everything sounds really tinny and weird. I'm just going to jump in my ship. And we'll see if that dulls the sound. There we go. That sounds a bit better. Jumping out. And I have to keep doing that on this planet. I don't know whether it's just on PlayStation 5. It could be... You know, if they're putting that new Discord update. Who knows? But anyway, people. I have now got myself an Atlas card level one and um omnus gaunt gave me a whole load of metal and i've managed to get myself a couple of um, upgrades there sadly i wasn't very lucky i didn't get much from my uh, multi-tool just one more module there and it's not a very good one at that so i need to go get myself my own glass by attacking sentinels but at least i've got one now to do that with and hopefully i might be able to last a little bit longer against the sentinels something i could do with doing is just up upping my life support there we go and i think we're good i think this is a good place to end off people so what an awesome episode we've got a manufacturing facility and it's right on professor cynical's doorstep which i think is pretty hilarious i'm just going to jump back over there and get a thumbnail for my video but yeah good fun until next time people goodbye goodbye and goodbye again Captain, Captain Steve, thanks all his new members and backers. Thank you, Sir Ominous Gaunt. Thank you, Rob Roll. Thank you, B Turtle. Thank you, 1975 Adam. Thank you, Stephen Jardine. Thank you, Bow Chaser. Thank you, Mike 2K. If you can back my channel through membership or Patreon, they keep my channel going on.